Appaloosa horses are easy to recognize with their fun patterns of spots. From the classic blanket Appaloosa with a dark base color and spots only on their hips, to leopard Appaloosas like Sedona with a light base coat and dark spots all over her body, to varnish roans like Opal with a mix of light and dark hairs throughout. Opal, however, didn't always look this way. Most varnish roans are born with spots and change colors throughout their lives. Baby Rio was born as a solid sorrel, but he's been getting more and more spots as he gets older. So he could end up looking like Monma Sedona or Auntie Opal or something else entirely. That beautiful coat pattern comes with a built-in risk, however. The gene that gives Appaloosas their mottled skin and fun spots also carries eight times the chance of going blind compared to other breeds of horses. Moon blindness, or equine recurrent uveitis, is a form of autoimmune disease that results in bouts of eye inflammation. It results from both genetic and environmental factors. While any breed of horse can have ERU, it is most prevalent in Appaloosas, drafts, paints, and warm bloods. In the classic form, horses experience recurrent episodes that get more frequent over time and can be painful. This is more common in warm bloods and draft horses. In what's known as the insidious form, which is what Appaloosas tend to have, the inflammation is persistent rather than episodic and thankfully doesn't tend to be painful. But Appaloosas are also four times more likely to go blind from the condition than other breeds. Recent research suggests that the LP gene is responsible and that horses with two copies of the allele, such as those with a leopard pattern like Sedona, are at the highest risk. Appaloosa eyes are different from other horse eyes, with light or mottled skin around the eye and a greater amount of sclera, or white, of the eye, which may factor into their increased re risk of moon blindness. All eye conditions should be treated seriously. In the case of moon blindness, or ERU, symptoms include excess tearing, squinting, sensitivity to light, a blue tint to the cornea, and redness in the sclera, or white part of the eye. A vet can diagnose the condition, and progress can be slowed with anti-inflammatories, other medications, or surgery, so it is important to diagnose and start treating early to manage any pain and extend vision. However, there is no known cure. So it's important to monitor your horse's eye health carefully to make sure they get treatment if they need it. Want to know more about moon blindness or equine recurrent uveitis? See the links at the end of this video.